The following is part of one of our firm meditations. To access all of our content, please go to numabreath.com or become a patron at the all material tier at patreon.com slash numabreath. See our links in the description. May you be blessed as you enter into this meditation. Revelation 1 verse 5 And from Jesus Christ, who is the faithful witness, and the first begotten of the dead, and the prince of the kings of the earth, unto him that loved us and washed us from our sins in his own blood. Jesus Christ. Let's begin with him. For he is the beginning and the end. Begin to see Jesus and begin to whisper his name. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Yeshua. Yeshua. This verse says that he is the faithful witness. And he is faithful. A witness of God's love. That he is faithful. Faithful to fulfill the prophecies of old. Faithful to endure to the end. Begin to say those words to Jesus. You are faithful. Lord, you are faithful. The Bible teaches us that He loved us and loves us. This verse says, Unto Him that loved us, He loved us in the beginning. He loves us now, and He'll love us in the end. Begin to say those words. He loves me. He loves me. Jesus the Messiah loves me. I am loved by God. In your own words. I want to affirm that truth over you, you listening right now. He loves you. He loves you. While you were in sin, He loved you. Before you loved Him, He loved you. And if He loved you while you were in sins, how much more will He love you now? that you are forgiven of your sins. You are loved. And this verse says that He, the faithful witness, He, the Prince of the Kings of the Earth, He, the first begotten of the dead, He washed us. He washed us. As I read this, 
begin to see yourself begin to see yourself with the Lord Jesus Christ see yourself filthy when you were in your sins see him washing you washing away the filth the shame the condemnation the judgment he washed us he washed you begin to say those words yourself I am washed just see yourself clean I am washed I am washed verse goes on to say from our sins this prince of the kings of the earth washed us from our sins you can even now think about and visualize the sins of your past the sins of your old life the sins of your darkness not to be condemned now but to remember what he has done for you what he actually washed you from and what is sin sin is darkness it's transgression of the law it's rebellion against the God who made you and loves you begin to think about those sins and as you do begin to see Jesus washing them away from you washing them away so that they're gone gone like dirt going down a drain gone washed from our sins this faithful witness this one so specific to our needs this high king coming down to us the one who loved us and washed us from our sins and the verse ends with these four words in his own blood in his own blood just whisper those four words right now in his own blood in his own blood you can say these words too I am clean in his own blood I am washed by his blood the Bible teaches us that there is no remission of sins without the shedding of blood in the Old Testament it was always blood almost all things it says in Hebrews was cleansed with blood so much animal sacrifice so many bulls lambs birds never enough 
And yet here we see one came, the faithful witness, Yeshua HaMashiach, who loved us, who washed us from our sins in his own blood. Before we move to the next verse, say the words as you meditate on what we just discussed. You can say them to Jesus, you can say them to yourself, you can say them to whoever you want. I am forgiven. Through Christ, I am forgiven. Go ahead. beautiful is love for us you are forgiven through his blood he loved you and he has washed you Christian in his own blood no one else's blood no animals blood but Jesus Christ the Son of God the Messiah has washed you in his own blood you are forgiven you are forgiven thank you for being part of the Numa breath experience there is so much the holy spirit is doing and we invite you to go deeper as the lord directs your prayers and support is appreciated and your comments provide us with such encouragement the lord bless you all